All right, guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to some more Vigor. And uh, today, guys, uh, we're going to do something different. We're going to do a tips video on crafting. So with all that, let's just get to the table and I'll show you guys what I know. And I hope it helps. So if it helps, definitely uh, leave a like uh, down there. It helps me out greatly. So we're going to go to the table, guys. And this is how it works, guys. This is how the crafting recipe and all that garbage works. You want to go to uh, the shelter here. And if we go to the shelter, guys, we can see in the first category here, right here, this first category, I have three of ten, means my crafting table. If you look over in the top right corner underneath my gamer tag symbol there and, and everything, guys, crafting table tools, level three of ten. So you can get up to level ten in the crafting table. The higher the level you are at the crafting table, the more weapons and items you can craft like if we go down here until we have a red on the little piece of paper there means it's locked and if you go down to the very bottom right hand corner you can see it requires level four of the crafting table so until i unlock level four i can't craft that weapon now if we go back to the table You'll see what it requires to go to level four is I need more nails, wire, metal parts, and chemicals. So I need to go out and loot, bring that back, and eventually I can uh, level it up. So if you just go out there, grind, guys, you can you can level up your uh, you can craft your weapons. Now, <clears throat> let's go into parts. Say I have this A74K bayonet here. Now, say the recipe's locked, guys, but I have enough parts. If we see the little spring-like looking thing, that's your parts symbol. And if you see right beside that, I have three of those. Only requires two to craft it. If I didn't have the recipe, guys, I can still craft that item because I have enough parts. Let's go down here to where something's locked and maybe we have an overabundance of the parts. Let's see if we can find one, hopefully maybe not all right here we go the puku or the puko whatever you want to call it guys it requires level seven to craft it on the table therefore the recipe's locked but i have enough parts for it so guess what i can craft it without the recipe so there's two ways about crafting the weapons in this game guys the first way is gaining enough parts for that said weapon it doesn't matter which one it is if you have enough parts for it you can craft it without the recipe now to gain the recipe you need to level your table up simple as that and that my friends is how you use the crafting table works the same on items i think uh antibiotics first aid heals like that um, you can actually maybe find the recipes in drops and stuff. I found the uh, bandage one, so now I can craft bandages. I don't think there's a level for that. I may be mistaken. Leave it in the comments section below if you like, if you want to correct me on that. It ha may have something to do with the level of your herb, your garden, to where you can craft said bandages and stuff. But I swear I got one of the recipes in a drop the other day. And that's why I can craft bandages now at uh, whatever my <laughs> table is at for the for the garden here. So hope this helped you guys out. Definitely leave a like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Helps me out greatly. And as always, guys, until next time, look at them. <laughs> we'll see you later.